launch modic images plus activate your camera icon this is a picture of uh, xylem tissue Mm. we'd like to take a picture of this by simply clicking on the camera icon in the top right corner this will take the picture in our modic live imaging module simply click on the image to activate it into the application software modic images and then you're free to go in and label it so uh, the labeling characteristics uh, you can choose your line color in this case we're going to use black you can change the thickness of your line and the fill color once you've selected that, you can simply go in and identify the structures that you'd like to label. And you, now we'd like to add text to those. So down to the bottom left-hand corner is the text tool. Simply click on the T for text. And when you click on the image, it'll open up a text tool. You can change the font. Uh, in this case, let's make it bold and a little bit bigger. And you can also change the color. It's uh, pretty much standard for any uh, word type document. In this case, uh, these are the xylem tissue. So we'd like to activate the text tool. And once you click on it, you can move it wherever you'd like. And then to make your next selection, you need to reactivate your text tool. This is the phloem tissue. And then again, uh, you can move the new text box wherever you'd like in your image. And then finally, activate your text tool again to label your, in this case, uh, pith cells. Once we finish with that, we can now uh, save the image or we can import it into our report format. And by doing so, now the students can make a report out of this. Again, your text tool and your font characteristics uh, will make this bold a little bit larger for our title. Uh, activate the text tool. This will open up a text box and the text box uh, ZMAs and we'd like to open up another text box change our font back to a normal script say okay open up our text this is the typical monocot plant used to use to view the arrangements of the vascular bundles. And once you're finished, you the students can simply go in here and, and move this wherever their text box is. Uh, everything is independent. You could preview what it looked like and then simply hit the uh, close this out and you're finished.